Review. Welcome one, welcome all to the new season of the MRC, the Mod Nation Racing Championship. 28 of the most exciting, exploding, life-threatening demolition kart races in the whole wide world. Mod Nation Racers aims to do for kart racers what Little Big Planet did for platforming games. That is, apply the play create share ethos to its characters, carts, and tracks. In that respect, the game is a resounding success. The tools are not only easy to use, but also incredibly powerful, allowing an already active community to pump out some brilliant creations. The single player mode may be tough at times, but it's well worth playing through to unlock a lot of the new creative content. But the game really comes into its own in multiplayer, both in split screen and the excellent online mode. This is the main Mod Nation Racers hub, which connects all of the play, create and share elements of the game. If you're online, the hub is populated by other racers who you can talk to, challenge to a race or view their profile to download their creations. The hub also highlights some of the highest rated content from users around the world, be it statues of user created mods or carts that have been made to look like locomotives, aeroplanes or even the A-Team van. You can then drive up to any of these creations and press the square button to browse, rate or download anything that you see. Mod Nation Racers covers all of the kart genre staples that you should be used to, including drifting and drafting, as well as power-ups and boost pads. That said, it also includes plenty of mechanics all of its own, including a power bar that can be used to boost, sideswipe opponents, or as a temporary shield. The weapons also become more potent as you collect more power-ups, meaning you have a choice of firing off a single shot, or waiting for something more powerful. These mechanics mean that Mod Nation Racers is a more advanced kart racer than most, and ultimately a deep and rewarding experience. In the single player career mode, you take control of Tag, a graffiti artist turned mod racer. The career structure is based mainly around standard races, but there are also stunt challenges and grudge matches to keep things fresh. You progress to the next race just by finishing third or higher, but the idea is to meet certain extra criteria, such as earn 3,000 drift points, in order to unlock extra content. The AI is particularly tough though, especially as you progress through the career, but you're rewarded with extra content for pushing through and learning the tracks. When you leave the AI behind and start playing in multiplayer, the game really starts to come into its own. Split screen is fast and enjoyable, while the online integration is very well implemented. Jumping in and out of ranked and unranked matches is simple, while missing content is downloaded to your machine seamlessly and automatically. You can also communicate with other racers by using text, gestures or voice chat. There are three separate creation elements to the game. Tracks, carts and player characters. Player characters are known as mods, and you can customise everything from their skin, clothes and face, to stickers, props and voices. You can easily create something unique, while advanced creators can use Photoshop-esque layering techniques to combine multiple stickers and create logos. The cart creator is also very similar, allowing you to quickly drop in body parts and fine-tune the colour and placement of every item. And if you're not in the creative mood, you can just randomise a creation, choose from one of the pre-made ones, or download something from the community. As impressive as these tools are, the track creator is undoubtedly the most impressive part of the package. Thanks to the accessibility of the tools, it's a lot easier and faster to build a decent track in Mod Nation Racers than it ever was to build a decent level in Little Big Planet. You build a track by driving it out in the same way as you would a cart, and the game automatically adapts with bridges and tunnels. From there, you can ask the game to automatically populate the course with accessories, and you can be up and racing in a matter of minutes. Once you've made your creations, you can then share them online, assigning keywords as well as whether they can be remixed by other people in future. Item downloads, views and ratings all add to your Create XP, which helps your creations rise up the rankings for other players to find. There's already plenty of great new content out there thanks to the active community, and all the best stuff naturally floats to the top. Mod Nation Racers has some of the best creation tools of any console game yet, while the seamless sharing options make it easy to experience new content without ever even having to think about it. 
The AI can be tough, making the career mode a bit of a slog at times, but if you're a kart racing fan with friends to play and a creative streak, then it's well worth checking out. Talk about rotating your tires. <laughs>